Carlos Alcaraz was left red-faced after Wimbledon host Annabel Croft branded him hot. Alcaraz, 21, wrapped up his second triumph at SW19 on Sunday afternoon as he battered Novak Djokovic in straight sets. And when Djokovic, 37, was being quizzed by Croft, she accidentally left the Spaniard blushing. Such a hot, talented opponent in Carlos Alcaraz, Croft started as center court erupted into laughing, leaving Alcaraz looking slightly uncomfortable. However, the presenter quickly clarified what she meant, with a nervous laugh, he was on fire. This lady just called Alcaraz hot on live television I mean, she's not wrong, but, one fan joked on social media. Well a second said, she said what we were all thinking. Yes Alcaraz is hot. Annabelle Croft's going wild, calling Alcaraz hot, a third said. And another added, when Annabelle Croft asked Djokovic what it felt like to play such a hot, talented opponent I think we all felt that. Djokovic laughed at the slip of the tongue from Croft before playing with the crowd, that's what I was about to say. He was definitely very hot today. Obviously not the result I wanted especially the first few sets. The level of tennis wasn't up to par from my side. Credit to Carlos. He had it all today. I saved the three match points. I extended the match a bit. But he was an absolutely deserved winner today. Huge congratulations. Alcaraz has now the last two men single Wimbledons on the bounce, and he doubled up for the season after already claiming the French Open in the spring. He said, honestly, it's a dream for me, winning this trophy, says Carlos Alcaraz after clinching his second Wimbledon title in as many years. I think in an interview when I was 12 or 11 years old, I said that my dream is to win Wimbledon so I'm really achieving my dreams. I want to keep going but it's obviously a great feeling to play in this court, in this beautiful court. I'm going to say it, I've said it before, for me, it's the most beautiful tournament the most beautiful court and obviously the most beautiful trophy.